Hey fellow world warriors, it's Angry Turtle and we are on the public test server. I just want to update you about incoming mutation, enemy mutation for daily ops and public events. Reflective skin periodically reflects direct damage to its source, how it works and how to deal with it. It is a very quick video, just this one topic as I know you are probably curious about it and how those enemies work. So let's say I'm using this flamer. That's a direct damage weapon. And I find some of the enemies. Hopefully I will heal a little bit so I don't die instantly. Hopefully. Oh, you see them? They look like frozen. And then they go into normal states. Normal states, you can shoot and kill them. They do nothing. But if you shoot the guy like that, you kill yourself. And not the guy. That's how this reflective skin works. It basically applies huge damage on you. There is not much you can do resistance wide and so on. As I'm wearing power armor. I have perks. I will still kill myself faster than I can kill enemy in case of this effect. But there is a workaround. If I use weapon like, for example, auto grenade launcher that toss explosives. So it's not a direct damage weapon. Then I find this glowing enemy, I start tossing grenades on him. And you can see I'm doing a little bit of damage to myself from explosion of the grenade. But I'm not getting any damage deflected on me from the enemy. And the same situation if I choose to use uh, like a mine. Let's say Nuka mine. I change for instigating weapon so I will have a little bit more damage. I find enemy, they need to be somewhere. There is one, that's the one that I killed myself before. Oh, he just stopped flashing. But generally you can kill him with explosive, whichever source it is. It doesn't matter what source of explosion it is. It can be auto grenade launcher. It can be other weapon that is tossing explosions as long as you are not doing a direct damage. And even if you hit enemy directly with auto grenade launcher, it's still not a direct damage as auto grenade launcher have like one point of direct damage and I killed them both. I did zero damage to myself. So this new mutation is basically promoting use of any type of explosives, which is, I would say, tricky a little bit. If Bethesda will not give us anything to reduce those visuals, yeah, we'll see what happens, because there will be way more explosions going on, as this is a recommended approach to deal with enemies that do have this new mutation. Reflective skin. So, if you don't want to kill yourself, you'll be using explosives. And what do you think about it? Let me know. That being said, this is everything for this video, and see you soon in the next one.